The film producer Lord Putnam was in Stoke-on-Trent today to open a pioneering new school that aims to help pupils who've dropped out of mainstream education. Innovation School Stoke is part of a not-for-profit education trust that works with some of the region's most challenged young people. It currently has seven young people on its role. Uh, Callum Watkinson went along to see what they made of Lord Putnam's visit. It's a long way from Hollywood to Stoke-on-Trent, but multi-award winning film producer Lord Putnam was here today to launch Innovation School Stoke. Based within an existing school, its aim is to re-engage children who have given up on mainstream education. And the veteran movie maker believes TV and film are tools well suited to that task. It's impossible to imagine young people not being engaged with the audiovisual medium uh, in a way that wasn't likely. 20 years ago or even 10 years ago. I mean, you know, the mobile phone is their, is their, is their tool of choice. That's what, they, that's what they do. The technology itself offers a lot more avenues to learning, to understanding, to communicating than, uh, than, the, than the traditional teaching methods. Perhaps best known for the historical drama Chariots of Fire, which swept the board at the Oscars in 1982, Lord Putnam has been involved in education for almost as long as he's been making films, with a particular interest in the special needs of those left behind by the crowd. Sitting in on a filmmaking masterclass, 13-year-old Tom has Asperger's syndrome, was bullied all through primary school and has been taught at home by his mother ever since. He's one of the seven children ISS is trying to help. His reaction to meeting Lord Putnam, a clue perhaps, as to the size of the challenge now facing those responsible for his education. Kind of reminds me of Robin Williams for some reason. In what way? I don't know, maybe his beard. Is filmmaking something that you might be interested in later in life, do you think? Uh, not really, I don't think I'd have the skills. All of our children that we've got on roll at the moment have disengaged from education, some of them disengaged from, from life really, and they've been really isolated for very different reasons. You, you wouldn't want your own child going on that journey. They've, they've been on sort of horrific journeys, really. So we're trying to unravel that. A noble, yet undoubtedly challenging endeavor. And it's hoped this will be the first of many visits by those at the top of their profession that might provide these children with a little inspiration. Callum Watkinson, ITV News, Stoke-on-Trent.